crude distillation adjusting pump around flows. This is Norm Lieberman speaking to you from my country house in southern Louisiana. I want to talk to you briefly about adjusting pump around flows. I mean, when you increase a pump around to extract more heat from the tower, obviously, certainly, the tower top reflux goes down. And the lower reflux rate then reduces fractionation efficiency. Well, that is not necessarily true. Because let's say the upper trays of the tower were suffering loss of tray efficiency due to entrainment. Then increasing the pump around rate, which will reduce the vapor rate, which will reduce the vapor liquid traffic on the trays, which suppress entrainment, and fraction nation would get better. So when you adjust the pump around rate in order to enhance fractionation efficiency, how then does one know whether to increase or decrease the top pump around rate to maximize, in this case, fractionation efficiency between naphtha and jet fuel? Well, one could wait for laboratory uh, results, but that takes a while. So the way I would do it is I would look at two temperatures. The pump around draw temperature or the jet fuel draw temperature as compared to the tower top temperature. If that temperature difference is getting bigger, then fractionation is getting better as you reduce the pump around rate. As you increase the pump around rate and fractionation gets better, in that the temperature difference is spreading apart between the top and the jet fuel drawer off, that's a sign that the trays were suffering from loss of fractionation efficiency due to jet flood before you did anything. 